Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and grow as a designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how you can duplicate a shape and rotate it around a specific point in Adobe Illustrator. So to start with, I've got a new artboard open and I'm going to select the rectangle tool, left click and drag to create a vertical rectangle like so. I'm going to remove the stroke and then select the fill and just give this a solid black fill. Let's just make that a little bit shorter there. Now with this shape selected, I'm going to select the rotate tool and underneath, so if I line my cursor up with the center of the shape and then move down to about here, I'm just going to single left click and you'll see that it moves the registration point below and central to the shape. Now, if I click over here somewhere, just left click and drag that out, you'll see that it will start to rotate the shape around this point. So suddenly that new registration point becomes the center focal point that this shape will rotate around. However, we don't want to actually move this shape that we've created. We want to create a copy of it. So still holding down that left click, if you hold down the Alt key as well, you'll see that this secondary mouse icon appears. That indicates that we are going to create a copy when we let go of the mouse. So let's do that now. Let's just let go. Try that again. There we go. Now without pressing anything else, press Command D on the Mac or Control D on the PC and it will repeat your last action. And as our last action was creating a shape, rotating it around that registration point, it will continue doing exactly the same thing, creating copies of this shape, rotating it around that same registration point. Until you end up with something like this. Now, obviously, this isn't spaced out correctly. So if we undo that, so maybe next time we just don't rotate it as much. So let's try that again. Click, rotate, and then we'll repeat. And then there we go. It's pretty spot on now. So it sometimes takes a little bit of kind of adjusting the rotation. So you might move it out a lot more, a lot less, just so you get equal spacing. If anyone does know of an easier and more precise way to do this, then I'd definitely be interested to hear in the comments. But as always, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please feel free to leave a like. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Take care and I'll see you next time.